Urjit Patel is an Indian economist, who formerly served as the 24th Governor of the Reserve Bank of India, and also Deputy Governor of Reserve Bank of India, looking after monetary policy, economic research, financial markets, statistics and information management. He resigned from his post on 10 December 2018, being the first RBI governor to state personal reasons as a driving factor for resigning. He is the fifth RBI governor to have resigned from his post before his term ended in September 2019. Urjit currently serves as chairman of National Institute of Public Finance and Policy, additional director of Britannia Industries and independent director of John Cockerill India. Chapter 1 Early Life and Education Urjit Patel was born in Nairobi on 28 October 1963 to Manula and Ravindra Patel. His grandfather had migrated from Mahuda village in Kada district, Gujarat to Kenya in the 20th century. His father ran Rexo Products Limited, a chemical factory in Nairobi. He studied in Nairobi at Jamhuri High School, and prior to that the Gujarati community run Visa Oshwal Primary School. He also studied at Loughborough Technical College. He studied at Queen Mary University of London and was awarded Bachelor of Science degree in 1984. He obtained an M.Phil degree from University of Oxford in 1986. He was conferred a PhD in economics from Yale University in 1990. He was at IMF India desk during the 1991-94 transition period. Chapter 2 professional career. After obtaining his PhD, Patel joined the International Monetary Fund in 1990, where he worked on the US, India, Bahamas and Myanmar desks till 1995. Thereafter he went on deputation from the IMF to the Reserve Bank of India, where he played an advisory role in the development of the debt market, banking sector reforms, pension fund reforms, and targeting of real exchange rate. Between 2000 and 2004, Patel worked with several high-level committees at both central and state government levels. Task Force on Direct Taxes Prime Minister's Task Force on Infrastructure Group of Ministers on Telecom Matters Committee on Civil Aviation Reforms Expert Group on State Electricity Boards High-Level Expert Group on Civil and Defence Services Pension System. Competition Commission of India On the 11th of January 2013, Patel was appointed as Deputy Governor of RBI for a period of three years, he was appointed for another three-year term in January 2016. On 20 August 2016, he was appointed as the Governor of Reserve Bank of India. During his tenure, the Government of India demonetized the 500 rupees and 1000 rupee banknotes of the Mahatma Gandhi series, with the stated intention of curbing corruption, black money, fake currency and terrorism from the 9th of November 2016. On the 10th of December 2018 at 17, 15 hours ISD, Urjit Patel resigned from the post of Governor of the Reserve Bank of India effective immediately. Chapter 3 Controversies Although Patel cited personal reasons for resigning from RBI, experts have opined that he was forced to exit because of serious differences with the government of India. The latter wanted more money from RBI to fund its fiscal deficit, which Patel did not agree to, citing requirement for long-term financial stability. In August 2019 Nitin Gadkari fueled the controversy when he stated that he had advised the Union Finance Minister to throw out the RBI governor because the latter was inflexible and adamant. Chapter 4 – Important Positions Non-resident senior fellow, the Brookings Institution, Washington D. C. Advisor, Boston Consulting Group President, Reliance Industries Executive Director, Infrastructure Development Finance Company Member, Integrated Energy Policy Committee, Government of India Non-Executive Director, Gujarat State Petroleum Corporation Non-Executive Director, Multi-Commodity Exchange of India Limited Deputy Governor, Reserve Bank of India Governor, Reserve Bank of India Chapter 5 
books and papers. Some of Urjit Patel's publications include Overdraft, Saving the Indian Saver, published by HarperCollins. Challenges of Effective Monetary Policy in Emerging Economies, in Monetary Policy in India, A Modern Macroeconomic Perspective, Editors, Chetan Gatte and Kenneth M. Kletzer. Springer. Fiscal Rules in India, Are They Effective? In Chetan Gatte, The Handbook of the Indian Economy, Oxford University Press, Oxford, and New York. Dynamics of Inflation Herding, Decoding India's Inflationary Process, Brookings Institution Global Working Paper No. 48. Does the exuberance in the Indian power sector have legs? Brookings Institution Global Working Paper No. 45. Infrastructure in India, The Economics of Transition from Public to Private Provision. Journal of Comparative Economics Vol. 38, pages 52-70. China-India Symposium. Decarbonization Strategies, How Much, How, Where and Who Pays for Less Than or Equal to 2 Degrees Celsius, Brookings Institution Global Working Paper No. 39. Excessive Budget Deficits, A Government Abused Financial System, and Fiscal Rules, India Policy Forum Vol. 2. Pages 1-54. Brookings Institution Care. Exchange Rate Policy in Encyclopedia of India. 2006. Edited by Stanley Vorput. Thomson Gale slash Scribner. The Financial Leverage Coefficient, Macroeconomic Implications of Government Involvement in Intermediation, Working Paper No. 157, Center for Research on Economic Development and Policy Reform, Stanford University. Large Foreign Currency Reserves, Insurance for Domestic Weaknesses and External Uncertainties. Economic and Political Weekly. International Trade and Internal Organization, Journal of Economic Behavior and Organization. Aspects of Pension Fund Reform, Lessons for India, Economic and Political Weekly. Macroeconomic Policy and Output Co-Movement, The Formal and Informal Sectors in India, World Development. Optimal Policies in a Dynamic Oligopoly Model of International Trade, Economics Letters. Debt, Deficits and Inflation, An Application to the Public Finances of India, Journal of Public Economics. Chapter 6, Awards. Recipient of the Wilbur Cross Medal, Yale University, October 2019. Citation from Dean's Letter, This award not only recognizes your work as the 24th Governor of the Reserve Bank of India, it is a testament to your achievements in public service and your many contributions to scholarship. Elected Honorary Fellow, Linacre College, University of Oxford 2019.